Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Captain Shaq here, and welcome back to Empire War Forces of Corruption. Fantastic real-time strategy game. Came out ages ago. If you never played it and you really are looking for some Star Wars goodness, specifically if you're trying to get geared up for squadrons, if you want to play from the tactical admiral perspective, leading, in this case, we're playing a mod, we're playing Fall of the Republic, leading the Republic to victory against the Separatists, well, Empire War is the way to do it, and it's huge list. It's library of mods. Definitely check it out. I've covered basically like all of them. Anyways, back to the campaign. We're doing our best to free the galaxy from the Separatist influence in the north. Uh, we're kind of at the tail end of the campaign, I think. Let's turn on all the things. See what we've got going on. Uh, there were some comments in the last one where I forgot to use Kit Fisto for Mon Cala, uh, which is kind of funny because the whole like campaign back here was to go take Mon Cala and every fight was really interesting from... Um, Oh, hell, all the way from Boss Petty inward. And it turns out Mon Cala's was like the easiest planet ever to take over. Yeah, yeah. A little anticlimactic, but it is what it is. We need to backtrack and take this world that we kind of knocked over the fleet for and then just passed through. Which I think is exactly what Mace is going to do as he digs in. We can use this as a production facility. Uh, we actually have already bought everything we need. If you see pop-ups, that means that I am streaming this over on Twitch, which I am. Uh, so if you hear me talking to the chat, that's what's up. Ivan, thank you so much for the tier one. Wow. Kind of losing track here. Mm. Well, thanks for the uh, thanks for the support, man. And 100 bits from Darth Joel. Ah, let's see. He says, do you mind, in in my mind, the CIS were sending all their forces out from Mon Cala to intercept you. Oh, I kind of dig that. We do have, we do have a little bit of trouble. Not too far away. But if I remember right, you know, we started building a uh, hypervelocity cannon. A little unnecessary to take that fleet on. I think our reinforcement fleet can actually deal with it if we put somebody in hyperspace position. So let's go ahead and do it. No Set up problem. our Pathfinder. Your orders, You're already building yours. Let's see if we can knock this retreating fleet away. And let's send Mace to Pamant and just get this wrapped up. Yeah, let's do that invasion. Uh, ground forces are about ready. Need to clean this up a little bit. You hold control, you can grab the whole group that way. And I think I'm going to put you in charge there. Uh, may, actually, no. Obi-Wan. Oh, oh, they made it. Couldn't give them orders in time. I think we can handle this. It's just a recousin. Mr. Titan, thanks for the five gifted subs. I appreciate that. Ospero and Degatus. Waltz, Super, and MGM. You guys are all now subbed. I'm excited. I'm excited for some squadrons coming out. We're finally getting a space game. Ready to commence. I just hope it's. I hope there's enough there to grab people. Choose your reinforcements. And they figure out their ability to do community events. I was talking to. Uh, yeah, let's just kind of jump in right in front of Copy them and see general. if we can get those engines down before they have Homing a chance to in. escape. Call spotted. Cruising speed. Copy. Okay. Missile All units. Loaded. Focus fire on the engines. Nice. I just hope that they make it so we can actually host stuff. I got a message from uh, Eck and Corey Loses, Eckhart Slatter and Corey Loses today, and they were like, hey, do you want to be in a tournament? And I was like, yeah, let's do it. And then they tell me, oh, well, you know, we're doing it on a point system because we can't host, like, the way the tournament's going to end up working is that we can't host our own battles with, like, set people. What? So, so it, yeah, I don't know. It's gonna be, it's gonna be weird. I like that the community is trying to figure it out, but the fact that we still can't host servers, you know, in any kind of way, is just bizarre to me. Hey, Jordan, thank you for the hundred bits. Hey, Shaq, did you know that Planet Jabim was the site of the most humiliating defeat of the Republic? Suffered fifteen thousand clones dead. Whoa! No, I didn't. What's that from? Twenty six Jedi KIA. Tons of loyalists gone. Anakin learns the Force choke. What um? What's that from? We've knocked out the retreating forces now. I think we should put a space Building station on here. At the very least to uh, stall them. And if we can get it up to tier two, we might be able to fight off a small fleet. Because we'll get the uh, what, destroyers. Yeah. All right. Mace, you're going to stay on the deck. But I am going to move Anna, er, Anna again. Obi-Wan. Obi-Wan, come with me. Complete. I must have spent too much time on Kamino. Let's start dropping. Archangel, thank you for the gifted subs. They're kind of sub-bombing me today. I appreciate that. Thanks for the support. Oh, uh, if you're watching old videos on YouTube, particularly old Empire War ones, uh, there's about 2,000 videos or more on my channel over the last, like, seven or eight years. Uh, YouTube, 
not too long ago, did a thing where they made it so all of my videos have uh, mid-roll ads in them now that didn't before. And that sucks. Let's br drop the two, two twelfths down. Uh, I'd have to go through all 2,000-something of those and turn them off individually. So, yeah, if you see a lot of those, that's not my doing, and I'm going to try to fix that, but it's going to take me some time. Uh, oh, are the alert boxes off? I just turned it back on. They're on now. You have the 212? Yes. Awesome. We should give you guys some support. This looks like it's going to be a bit of a slog. Let's grab some anti-air immediately. Took a while. The squad just together. secure that point right there. Yes. And uh, do we want to go Juggernaut? We got an A5, or we could go Walkers. I say Light Walkers. I check your map. Maximum unit capacity. We're at max cap right now. As long as we get air. Turret constructing. Some anti-air we should be okay. And we'll put a back to tank here. Dig in. Mm, let me get Obi-Wan. I'm sure you'll win next time. I'm gonna send you and a half different to face an experienced Jedi. The whole isn't it? Not bad for an old man, eh? I'm glad you are in that direction. Here to see this. Oh man, you're not an old man. Okay. We we're right next to Mon Cala. Question on where we were. Move you guys up. So, heavy armor can sit here, Let's and then we'll go. let you go in and back them up. So the plan is, winning the battle will give you a base influence of three, destroy all enemies. Uh, there is a capture point on this one, even though it's not in the description. So we are going to have to move. Come on, run. Yeah, move slowly and in cover. Let's see if we can get up there. We have to capture that point. Secure the zone. I've got point. Obi-Wan, you kind of left the entire <laughs> attacker you. back there. You, no, no craps given. He's going in. Sure, why not? Da -da 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 -da. Well, if I can grab this, I can drop victory. reinforcements. Much closer. Hostiles in the area. Yes. If you had the choice in this game, in this mod particularly, would you want to see the ground build cap upped? It definitely feels, for me at least, very restrictive early on. And I'm not convinced of crap. Fire, 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 fire. Let's bring in an A5 back here. Uh, and some artillery support in the back. Uh, it definitely feels... Oh, we've got... We've got... No, 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 no. We got two A5s. Hold out, boils. We got crabs. Spread out. Take cover. Kill them now. I've got nine of these lats. I might as well start using them. Let's bring them in. I, I kind of like that you're a little restricted because it makes you come up with a plan. If you want a proper, like, ground force, then you're going to have to start moving. Uh, you're going to have to start gaining territory early, and how you do that is kind of up to you. Uh, let's hit the walker, continue to move, and let's turn around and start firing some rockets. Okay, keep moving. If you make it there and capture it, I can bring you reinforcements. As for the rest of you, we have to get to that capture point or we're going to lose, so let's move. Lats, rockets away. Look at them, look at them. Man, the damage on the lat's actually pretty great. I mean, it is a gunship. It's just so slow and so awkward to use. Rockets are looking good. Switch targets. We're going a little too deep. Let's see if we can pull back. There is not secure. Let's hold position here for just a second. And let's get our second group moving as soon as we capture this. Wow, you've been beat to hell. You haven't won yet, old friend. We lost many good Jedi on Genosis. Their sacrifice will not be Now that their shields are kind of back up, let's see if we can wreck some stuff. Go for the armor. Is this bombing run territory? I don't feel like we're there yet. They are going to lose the lats, though. Yes, A6. Show them that you're not terrible. In a lot of ways, you're a little more functional, I think, than the A5. Or the A5. The A5 and the A6. Oh, okay, nope, nope, nope. Bombing run. Bring it in. Bring it in quick. Obi-Wan. Or just protect yourself and run away. All right, pop that. We can do a little confusion. To fall back. Get the armor moving up. Where's that bombing run? There they are. Bombs away. Nice. And then the lats arrive. Dramatically. Okay, we've got the location. We don't actually get more build cap. Now, that would be cool. Maybe if you captured more territory, you'd get more build cap. If we can swing in behind them, we can stop their production back here and actually capture this. 
All right, let's go. To be in your shoes Keep right moving. Now. What an extraordinary experience. Yeah, Somber, the, the space cap is really high in this compared to the ground cap, which is a little bit more... I almost want to say the word reasonable, but that doesn't seem right. Because it still feels good. Like, you can get these proper, like, clone battle lines, and it does feel like something right out of the show. Like, the numbers seem like they're based on what you'd see in the average show, where it kind of hint that there's a bigger battle going on on the planet, but you don't really see it most of the time. Yeah, there we go. And in the show, you'd get, like, four or five squads and some armor, and that'd be kind of it. All right, let's go ahead and move over here. All right, there's the cat point. Should be able to win here. You are good. What did we leave behind? A single squad. Oh, I didn't leave you behind. You're stuck. Of course you are. All right, clones, you actually get on the point. Get the A5 moved up. You're actually in the perfect spot. Stay right there. And we'll put the rockets in the bunker. It's you 212th. We secured a landing zone. Ember Prime, thank you for the 100 bits. Says, Thanks for the stream from Lockdown Durham. Are you like Durham, North Carolina? That's not too far from here. Well, I'm happy I could entertain if you're stuck indoors. I did leave them behind. <laughs> Alright, we gotta go. Get to the cap point. I would load infantry in these, but I don't want to kind of hot drop because I have a feeling that these transports are just gonna die. Get them, lats. Emergency! We do have an orbital strike, but I don't feel like we need it. I mean, the only thing I'd want to stop is this vehicle back here from running over my people, which you know what? Probably worth. Let's go for it. Give me a round from orbit. Thank you. Next. Oh, crap. I just used it. I just used it, and two of those come wandering around the corner. All right. Let's focus everything we've got right here. Where did you receive your intelligence? Obi, get up here. I nice, got it. It's such look. a bizarre sound. Come on. Come on, kill it. It's going to kill the lat. Ugh. That's all right. We got seven more. Eight more. This one hasn't died yet. All right. The point is ours. Now we hold. Let's see if I can set you up. There is a way to set the direction your units like hold position if you right click and you hold but it's kind of touchy it doesn't always want to go like see you won't let me turn this direction but i can search there Let's get a couple of turrets built get you guys spread out a bit took a while i can took a sense while. your frustration i'd hate hey, to be in your shoes let's go right now. infantry on the point you hold position right there. I have another bombing run, but I don't feel like I need it just yet. We might as well save it. Yes, we absolutely need it. Oh, there we Hey, gotcha. Oh, that's a good shot. Get the you are victorious. I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah, we lost that lap. Planetary control. Okay, planets under our control. Now, I'm doing it. I'm flicking on Cruel AI. So Cruel AI is now on. They will build faster and they get a ton of free resources. Will this make a difference? I don't know. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But I know a lot of you talked about it in chat. We should do it. So we're going to go ahead and do it. Uh, but I'm not going to stop being super aggressive and pressing the enemy as quickly as we can. And with that, how are your ground troops? I kind of light on what are these phase ones. You could use a reinforcement group. Hmm. Hmm. I can get you... I can get you a battle group there, but that's all space-based. Mostly victories and a couple of Venators. What I need to get you is some ground-fighting units. Uh, hmm. 
Quant, what have you got for ground units? Sabers for days. Uh, all right. Construction complete. Kit Fisto is getting a division and a half of armor. Let's do this. Missiles at the ready. They're on their way. Speaking of aggressive enemies. Wait, are you serious? This is it? This is all you're taking in. Construction. Bring it. Begin. Yeah, this should give us dreadnoughts. We should be able to take this. Hey, Darren Sewell. Thank you for the 15 months. Nice. I get to have a beer and watch Captain in action. My kind of Friday evening. Whoa, what in the world? My camera just went all cattywampus. What in the world? Reinforcements. Eh, Awaiting your orders, sir. Fixed it. Upgrade in progress. <laughs> Raisins. I don't know. Yeah, you got me. Come on, where's my on where's route. my other dreadnought? There it is. Part of me wonders if the AI doesn't see these stations as something that's like Ready really a threat, orders. just in, like in this version. Because look what they brought in, and they thought they could take this. It's not like that station wasn't there. Actually, it might not have been there. We could have been this building it at the time. Ship, you know. All right, let's move in. It's bizarre whether we get Tie Fighters. At your command. Nope. There we go. Without the line on it. So the fleet moves. The Saber tanks are my favorite in Star Wars. Okay, so Somber. We're talking about the new XCOM campaign, right? In the updated mod that adds the Empire replacing the Advent, one of the enemy units you have to fight is Saber tanks. As the Rebels, you know, or whatever if you're playing is like the, who knows, the clones or whatever versus. Hey, and Inra, welcome to the stream. One of the modders in the chat for Space Engineers. So yeah, that's a thing. Saber tanks. You don't get them though. And that's what frustrates me. The enemy gets them. I would love to have like a rebel just jacked version where we've stolen an Imperial Saber tank or one of the, um, the scout. What are the scout walkers for the clones? ATRTs? Is that? No. Yeah. Yeah. ATRTs. Uh, the, the little walkers with a single person on top. Um, the little scout walkers. Proto ATSDs. Uh, let's go ahead and break off and Clear engage the, the fighters. Let the rest of the fleet through. It looks like there's a hole. There's actually a navigational hole in the asteroid belt right here in the center, which they are able to go through without taking any damage. That's kind of cool. I don't know if that's from the vanilla map or what. It's been ages since I've played the vanilla map for any of these. Ready to commence. I don't know which one's which anymore. Reinforcements on route. Somebody mentioned one of the factions in Vanilla Sins of the Solar Empire while we were playing our D&D game. And I was like, the who? And they were like, dude, you've played tons of Sins. I was like, yeah, but when was the last time you played Vanilla Sins? When I've got the Star Trek Armada mod and the new Star Trek mod and the, what, two or three Star Wars mods, including Thrawn's Revenge? We're in firing range. Open up. Hopefully they don't run. Let's focus Awaiting on those engines orders, as quickly sir. as we can. That frigate needs to go. Sins has a vanilla mode. Indeed. Exactly. Okay, we're actually going to take that bug ship out as well. Perfect. Uh, and these are all free units, so I'm not super worried. Let's get the BTLs over here. Beta Squadron, get over here and target the ship's hyperspace drive. I need it taken out immediately. They all form in. Form up. Personally, I like the AATs and 10. Fair enough. AATs. <laughs> Empire War has a vanilla mode? Indeed. It's a vanilla campaign. You know, out of all the campaigns Ready we've done, we've never done an actual, like, vanilla campaign. Story campaign. I don't remember it at all. It's been ages. I was probably in, like, high school when that came out. Who knows? All right. Don't let them escape. We don't have an Ek here. We don't have a Peltus. We can't drop a gravity mine, so you have to kill them now. All right, he's not escaping, so let's kill the transport. The missile boat, excuse me. Come on, three seconds. Come on, I need some turbo lasers right There we go. Oh, almost escaped. There'll be no escaping this time. Arias, thank you for the tier one. Reporting for duty, Captain. Greetings from Germany. Hola. Totally going to a now. 
They've earned it. Let's see him take the asteroid belt with a tier three station on it. <laughs> uh, your reinforcements are in route. I think I'm going to take Yalaran and the rest of the fleet and start cracking robot skulls. There's no reason not to start blazing a trail through their territory on this side. How are we doing on this fleet? Yalaran's got, <laughs> that's right. He's got 24 Arquintons because of raisins. 18 Venators. And that, um, the, what I keep calling a Secutor, and it's not, it's a Praetor. But I'm bad, but I don't feel bad. Chat has told me a thousand times. You're wrong, Shaq. That's not what that is. You're not, Building started. you're not wrong. I am. Building started. Uh, ground forces. Tactical I need to give you, imminent. I need to give you a few more, damn it. I need to give you a few more, um, I wish I could give orders while it was paused. That's one thing that I absolutely wish, like you can do in, um, stars. Because right now, I, I want to give some phase two, we've got 22, uh, platoons, full platoons. I want to give a few of these units, uh, and a few of the arcs over to Kit Fisto for his invasion, because he's only got two platoons left. Uh, we don't have the space. I mean, I can't do it. I'm paused. The enemy has definitely gotten more aggressive. How did you get here? Seriously. How did you... There's no route. I've got stations in every direction, and there's no sneaky mechanic for you. And you still haven't gotten your hypervelocity cannon, which I think will be hilarious when you do. Uh, was it tier one station? I have to auto resolve it, and then I have to crush you. What uh, what death donut is this? Is this super death or minimum death? Wartime configuration. Ah, the super death version. Can I take you with this fleet? Oh, yeah. All right, we got new orders. Just come in. You Let's go. Quicker. We got to break a donut. Construction complete. Oh, I thought they attacked us again. I was like, man, the cruel AI is going ham. We have had, what, two attacks, three attacks so far? All right, let's break some donuts. Luger Hulks. If they do an expansion for squadrons, do you want, I'm curious what chat says, and for you guys in the comments, do you want to see Clone Wars era or an expansion to the Galactic Civil War? Where there's more stuff? Because right now we're only getting, what, four, four fighters in squadrons? U-wing, A-wing, Y-wing, X-wing? And there's a ton of like, Our here. Galactic Civil War stuff they could bring in. Pff, wow, okay, chat just went nuts with Clone Wars. How dare you? Clone Wars, Clone Wars, Clone Wars. Choose your reinforcements. Yeah, but we could get our our 41s, and we could get headhunters, and we could get, you know, the right headhunters. Oh, geez. Come on. Somebody's got to be on my side. Original trilogy. Thank you. Somebody said original trilogy. Balls. Vectoring now. Ty Uglies. How dare you, erotic jellyfish. I also love your name. Standing by. All right, Yalaren, take command of the on fleet. Your order. Uh, let me get a Eckhart's ladder here. Understood. We're moving out. Uh, I'm gonna call it that from now on. The Pelta. You got the captain. Boop. Field activated. They're not going anywhere. All right, now the field is activated, and then let's get super aggressive. Now they can't get away. We definitely have them on numbers. We've got our gravity yes, mine engaged. My players in our tabletop have been aboard a Pelta as their main base of operations for quite a while. Two real years of playing. They've used it. It's called the Mercy's Herald, a medical ship converted into a rebel cells base. And I am quite proud of that name. I think Mercy's Herald is an amazing name for a, a Pelta. All right, we should probably get a group of, like, victories over here to crack that bubble. Just to get it done a little bit quicker. We don't... They have lost a control point. Today's video... I don't know when this video is going to go live, but today's video that went out was a uh, spotlight for Space Battles and Battlefront 2 for Remastered mod. And they look amazing. And you can play it without, with, while playing with people who have the vanilla game in multiplayer, which is really cool. If you haven't seen that yet, Scream, check it out. Just flip through. Even if you don't want to watch the video, but if you're interested in the mod, just flip through it and you'll see what he's done is he's made it so they look like proper battles. One of them has the Super Star Destroyer in the background. Some of them have like retextured uh, actual ships and asteroid field and a couple of the new mo uh, maps. Very neat. Have we not killed this yet? Oh, man. Ready to update orders. Death Donuts have a lot of health. They get a ridiculous amount of health. I just got finished watching it. It looks amazing. Yeah. I'm going to try to stream a, an event tomorrow. So we can all get in and play. Harrison Fogg, the mod author, actually has a server that's up. Um, 
basically like all the time. We have a ton of Y-Wings, that's not what we need. Wait a minute, who's back here? We have a station? Okay, all squadrons, all BTLs immediately attack the space station. All V-Wings go after the hard cell transport. The rest of you sit around and look pretty. Where are our BTLs? There they are. When in doubt, scented more BTLs. Why is your fleet so oversized? Uh, there's no such thing as too much Naka. Late game, Aiden. Super late game. Yeah, it gets a little snowbally toward right. the end of the game. Well done, rookie. We're all set here, Commander. We've got secondary reinforcements sir. We need uh, to uh, uh, Oh yeah, and the fleet cap in this mod is 300. <laughs> Where the ground battles aren't actually that high. They aren't nearly that high. Oh, there's a gunship. Good. I hate those damn things. Those are awful. If we were to look at how many units that we have lost in this. It would be the majority of units, I think, that we've lost in this have been lost to assault ships. Uh, okay, you're already building your ground base. You guys should be en route. You're already building your extra space station. Right. Beginning I have no idea where they came from. Building under construction. They keep getting behind my line, and I'm not really sure how. Anyways, reinforcements are on the way to kill them. Um... How do we not own this planet? Didn't we take this? No, we didn't take this. We were planning to. Here's what I'm gonna... Oh, you're already en route. I'm gonna move the 212th and meet up with this battle group and combine them. Tactical battle imminent. In a minute, because Kit Fisto is hunting backline raiders and we have to deal with that. I haven't tagged the game in the stream. Oh, did I not put the game in? Jeez, I didn't. Cause I'm bad. Empire at war. Let's do that. Okay. They're already in play. The utmost professional. Okay. We want to. Oh, good. We do have a Pelta. One Pelta versus the fleet. Don't worry, he's got the. Oh, they're in firing range. Oh, crap, baskets. Okay. Venator. 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 When in doubt, Venator out. Yes. Pop that. Air cruiser standing by. Air cruiser standing by, raising anchor. What is that audio from? That is not... All power reverting the weapons. weapons. I don't... Why would they raise anchor? It's from something else. I know it is. It's gonna mess with me. Let's bring a Jedi in for fun. We could do some assault boats. Actually, that's exactly what we're gonna do. Assault boat, assault boat, assault boat. And then we're gonna do a little bit of repairs and a dreadnought. Go for the engines. Oh, what is that course? No. There you go. Drop your fighters and have them engage. There they go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Our back to packs will regenerate us. I don't say. All right, Venators, you're going a little too deep, and you're not actually targeting the main target. All BTLs, find something and blow it up. Bum, bum, bum. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got a Venator taking a hell of a lot of hits. Fall back. Let's give it a little bit more. Mm. We're trying to take him out. All hands, abandon ship. All hands, abandon ship. Oh, God, he's not going to make it. How much health does he have? Oh, they might have switched targets. Arcs, get in there. Go, 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 go. Is he getting out? He's still alive. I don't know. Is he taking hits? Yes. Yes, he is. 
Run! He, tell me he's gonna make it out. If he can just get out of firing range, it, he's starting to gain his shields back because they're not a subsystem. Greetings, young one. Go. Why don't we just dive right in? I'm onto him. He's gonna make it. Use the heal pelt up. Yeah, he'd never make it in time. Like the heal's okay, but it's not that fast. Better to start the fight with it in the formation than expect it to come over there and save the ship. Unless you can hyperspace it in. Or you're really close. Uh, All right, you won the day. We chased them off. We need to backtrack, and we need to give you... I think you and Obi-Wan are going to team up, because that's... Those are the two... Oh, damn it. Oh, never mind. I was about to complain. They were bringing their ground forces in. We definitely want to get dug in here. So about that AI being super aggressive... We've had an attack every, like, I don't know, six minutes? That looks pretty nasty. Yes, if you're on the ground. Your skills never cease to amaze. Drop all of the mines. So unnecessary. Three mines deployed. Activate. Gravity field. No one escapes. All targets die. As murky as a storm toss. All fighters. The Jedi will Go. crash like a wave on your armies and sweep them away kind of love that dialogue. Hold your position. And that's why Kit Fisto is one of the coolest Jedi. It's a Jedi who enjoys his life. <laughs> the Separatist war started. He starts living his best life. Yeah, I'm not going to bother sending the rest of the fleet forward. We should be able to do this with just fighters. Let's break the BTLs off because they're going to take so damn long and have them go the farthest. Since these guys can just immediately engage. We'll have a winner and a loser. We're looking at the winner. There we go. The reinforcements are coming in. They're in the line of fire. Wow, you Z95s are slow. Get in there. Eat concussions. Come on, come on, come on. Actually, I will bring the fleet over. Let's just do the Venators and have them kind of make their way over here. Yeah, they're not able to escape and they're about to lose a ton of credits. Not going to mean as much because of that killer AI's turn on, but... All right, let's speed this up. Ooh, I don't know if that's actually faster. Yes, it's kind of eating it. Greetings, young one. Why don't we just dive right in? Yeah, let's let's turn that off. Start focusing your fire. There you go. We must be sensitive to ripples and falls. Yeah, I'm going through, going around the nebula. You're fine. There's so many audio People things where they're like, I'm dying. It's no, it's a transport. You're fine. There we go. Green Day Man says, Squadrons are, will get old if you just have to rely on the multiplayer for a great game. Games need to have good versus modes, good solo modes. Not so much fun to be on I mean, they can get a lot of life out of it if they give us a map editor and let us host our own servers, but that's not going to happen. Because it's, yeah. They have this weird thing about hosting only on their platforms. It's bizarre. Using their weird matchmaking system and setting, letting us have, like, you know, community control so we can run all kinds of crazy shenanigans. Never forget to use your Ek balls. Oh god, is that what you guys are calling it now? Is that what the cool kids are calling it? Because that sounds really bad. All right, let's move quickly. Obi Wan and the reinforcements go. You You're gonna meet up here. We are going to break robots. Let's go. Go 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 go. As soon as they get. Oh hey look, the uh, saber tanks have arrived. Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! Invasion. And so the ground invasion begins. Saber tanks for days. That's my plan. Every time I do a plan that involves not using tons of clones, as in infantry platoons, it kind of blows up in my face. Really? That's the unit you decided to start with? 
Okay, whatever. So maybe we'll do a mix. We'll do like two sabers. Eh? Two saber groups and some arc troopers and a lat. Because the arc troopers can sprint. The sabers are fairly fast and the lat's just weird. And we'll fill the lat with as many. Oh, we can only hold two. <laughs> it's not going to work. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> this is going to blow up in my face again, isn't it? Yeah, no, for sure. For sure. But there's the saber tanks driving backwards, as they do. I think these still have stormtroopers in them, don't they? Yeah. Need a little bit of a model adjustment. Go, go, go. Get ready to move in. Come on, come on, come on. If we would have brought down normal platoons, we could have put two full squads inside this lab. Go back them up. Yeah, All right, we're running. We're running. Spr uh, nope, misclicked. You guys are group one. Double time. Stay in the battle zone. Look at him go. Do, 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 Where is the other saber tank? What did you do? Okay. Yeah. No, this is totally. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Nailed it, guys. <laughs> and suddenly rough terrain. Oh. Ugh, hoi hoi hoi. Okay, of course we can't capture this, but at least we can get there. And then, hey, somebody's driving like an It's just the way the game works, though. Why is it that saber tanks will drive backwards, but the base game has it so, like, ATSTs don't? Like, what's going on there? Let's keep moving. We need to capture this. Where are those? You're sprint more often than that. The droids we're looking for. No. What? That means you've seen droids. Yes, you have. Oh, no, 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 no. All right, fall back. Let the arcs get up here first. Have them take cover and kind of distract while the rest of you, these things are great at taking out armor, uh, move in. Maybe face them with the guns. I don't know. I'm just saying it might be useful. Hey, there you go. Wow, saber tanks. Where have you been all my life? Why have we not built more of you? There are three of these, and because the majority of the damage is going into the lat. Move forward. Yeah, see, as soon as they switch targets, now we're going to start losing them. Okay, arcs. Let's go. I know I'm sprinting while in cover. It's a terrible plan. Okay, return fire. Yep, run away. Yep, run away. Make them come to us. We need this capture point. I will let you engage as soon as we own this so I can bring in reinforcements. There it is. Let's go. When in doubt, Jedi out. Yeah, so we're going to go with it. Let's do a little artillery. Let's do a lot of artillery. Mwahaha. Oh, my poor. Run away, saber tank. There's the rest of you. Yeah, they got a lot of heavy units. Oh, shit. Oh, they killed it already. This is going to be fun. Greetings, Why don't we just dive right in? I love this plan. Let's get everyone who's not a deployable heavy cannon in the back. Go and wreck the enemy's face. All right, we did it. Dooku was lucky he faced Kenobi and Skywalker instead of you. Took a while. I'm thinking a repair center. Get these sabers repaired, and then we'll move up. They wanted the sabers to be able to back up, so they enabled the two-way movement. The downside of that is there's no preferred direction. Oh, okay. Gotcha. That makes sense, because you can't walk backwards with an ATS-T. I mean, you can. You can't in this game. Kind of like this, this armor unit we've got here. Oh, okay. Just deleted that droid. I'm a up. All right, Sabres, go Where ahead and report over here. All arcs, come over here. Get behind. What kind of general commands an army of droids? Our Nautilin friend. Let's get your repairs. Have you guys Don't move up? Don't misinterpret my smile. I take my training very seriously. He actually references that. He's always smiling with the fights. 
like we can do this. Can we do confusion on... Oh my god, you can. You can, conf you can confuse crap trucks. <laughs> and they must be considered infantry. It gets weird with, you know, droid... Oh, please. Please. Give me a bombing run that may be the most oh, perfect the bombing run since that one time we took out an entire row. Oh, how's he doing? Is he Fisto's gonna die! This fight will have a winner and a loser. No, 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 no. Where are you? Where are you, Kid Fisto? Run. Oh, you're right there. I, Just... I see you learned a thing or two from young Skywalker. <laughs> they take so much damage. How was the bombing run? Totally whiffed it. All right, well, that's that. Alright, armor? Let's roll. Bring him in a little bit closer and let the artillery soften him up. Nice, 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 nice. Should be able to push through this pretty easily. I mean, hell, big boy is not going to be able to do any damage. Uh, unless the artillery keeps missing. How did I miss that bombing run? Oh, did they get shot down? I didn't see it. I'm shocked Fisto's still alive. With the amount of damage he was taking. Let's go. Let's go. We're pushing in. We need to push in faster. Because every second they stay alive, the more damage we're taking. Round outbound. Nice. All right, we're pressing. Let's press up the hill and not down the way of the enemy. Yeah, no, run away. Hey, back it up. Well, some days I'm happy we can back up. Let the artillery handle this. We're gonna just run down this pathway. Kill them, arcs. There you go. Well, a super battle droid there giving us trouble. Every time something comes down this walkway, immediately gets greeted by, wait for it, there it is. A little bit of hey, how you doing from range. Keep walking. Don't stop. There you go. We have to go. Lockwood! Thank you for the 100 bits! The savers remind, uh, remind me of my dad driving. He's very skilled at driving. Backwards. Hmm. <laughs> Indeed. Nickel Knight, thank you for the 200 bits. It says, coffee's on me, Cap. Well, I do have my coffee in hand right now. So, I appreciate that. Let's roll. There's our capture point. Hold for 60 seconds. And now we hold. I don't know if we're in artillery range all the way back here. I'm a little concerned that the enemy is going to pop up nearby. Let me get there is you only one here and a platoon of clones on guard. Okay, nope. Hold position. You're perfect. Right where you are. I'll roll you up a little bit farther. Get you away from the infantry. Actually, let's set you guys up. Oh, it's kind of a cluster, but set up right there. Yeah, I think our artillery's out of range from up here. It's alright. Should be able to hold. He doesn't like you. We're capping. Oh, man. When you only have one of these, like, the damage What's doesn't that? seem like it's that much. When you get three, everything dies so fast, the amount of damage they're able to put out on it is just minimal. Whap, whap. Look at that. It's chunking these men. Now, if only we had some kind of support unit we could use. No, oh, no, 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 Arcs. Let's not go too deep. Stay within the cover. And let's grab a repair center right here. Like, if we could bring down technician crews or something. The Star Wars FFG books has a great, like, in-field mechanics tank. It, think of it like any one of those World War II vehicles that had... It was basically a tank, but it had, like, a hoist on the top. So they could drag damaged uh, armor back to a repair site, back to a depot. Basically that. A lot of times they'll have, like, 
anti-mine machinery on it or well there's a few of star wars variants of that which is quite cool looking there we go we got it bit of an uphill slug The battle is our... Oh, we lost the Saber Tank Company. I thought I saved that one. Control achieved. Good. Perfect. But we're not going to wait around. Let's bring the 212 bring her around. immediately here. Station up. It. Station up. Ground troops on the deck with phase ones. Let's do it. Invasion commencing. Begin the battle. X-Wing Alliance upgrade looks amazing. Dynamic cockpits, Blue Max's graphics mods, and you have total control over the multiplayer. I'm the Discord, and every weekend we have matches and custom modes. I didn't think that was out yet. You plan on playing XW Alliance? Unless I'm thinking of a different One, two, mod. Stay together. Oh, I might be thinking of X-Wing vs. TIE Fighter, the remake mod that's still in production. How many? What's the player cap on that for X-Wing Alliance? Oval Dreamin's in chat talking about it. Uh, what in the world is this map? Renvar is like tier defenses like crazy. Okay, uh, we're gonna get AA out first because I forever will forever live in fear of assault ships. We do have an A6, so let's go really hard on the assault. A6. Let Obi Wan. Your conscious self. Act on instinct. And because we're using an A6, I'm going to use it as an actual transport, so we'll bring in another platoon. We need to rush south, so we're going to load everybody up in the A6. Aha! I was ready for you! Eat laser cannon and get wrecked. Nice. Next! Next! I kind of love that you're out there just getting shot by <laughs> speeders. Programming is no substitute for a lifetime of training. Watch those wrist rockets. Let's He's go. He's so hey. cocky. He doesn't like you. Let's do this. He's Let's the Jedi of go. sass all the time. And I would never want you it any other way. Devil. Get in the bunker. Okay, one group stay out. I want to grab another defense point. You know there's a whole lot of hostile on its way. Incoming! Oh, they blew that up quick in a hurry. Didn't you once pose Obi, defend yourself! Yoga. There's a shit ton of assault ships! It's gonna be that kind of battle. Alright, we gotta go. Wait a minute, is this is this an infantry-only route into their base? Oh, it is. So we have two choices. We do full-on Arctic assault across the tundra, or we sneak through the back door with piles of infantry. I'll check it out, Oval Dream. You've got my attention. I'm looking for something that I can completely control the multiplayer with, because I want to do, like, the... Oh, my God, we're going to get... We're going to die. We're going to lose this A6. We got to drop. Combat drop. Go, 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 go. Now spread out quickly. Okay, as quickly as you can when I tell you to drop out. Ooh, turret. I can't order you to do anything. Oh, please tell me you're not stuck. Game is like too many units. Don't know what to do. Uh, we only have a group of saber tanks with this. Only one group. Hmm. How do we want to handle this? Do we want to push hard or do we want to go infantry? Ah! Uh, I think full on assault. Right, check your map. We are the 212th assault right, battalion, not the 212th sneaky sneaks battalion. Is. Mouthy as Obi Wan is, I think he would be the most direct general right he would play it by the book hey, he doesn't like you. Constructing. holy crap baskets i need that bombing run right now and by the book would be heavy assaults with armor backed up by infantry and artillery support and hopefully any bit of air power they can get oh we're taking hits mm, they might be out of the blast radius nah. we at least get half of them or all of them he's smoking Okay, we're good, sort of. 
Let's grab a repair platform and move the other armor up to take the brunt of the next attack, because here they come. Infantry, I need you up first because tanks are hard to replace. Sorry, but it's true. Uh, where's that artillery power? We need that a little bit closer. Let's deploy one and move the other one, and then we can kind of leapfrog them up. Repairs, please. Yeah, to this chat right now. I I don't know. 212 had a wide collection of spec ops and covert ops groups. Well, keep in mind, too, that battalions seem to have whatever the plot requires. Right? So, if it required them to have arcs, then they had arcs. If it required the 501st to have a reason for being there, then suddenly they had their special ops guys. Like, it, it was kind of all over the place. I always thought the assault portion of 212 was that they were really heavy in lats and like hot dropping into points. They were kind of like army rangers style deal, like hot dropping in. Um, let's go. But head cannon, best cannon. Bombardment available. Bombardment available. Good. Well, that'll give us a little bit of a break. Um, let's go forward and see if we can capture this. Is this the... No, it's not. So we're going to send that one platoon there. You guys are going to move up. Uh, I'm not going to bunker you up. Ow, commando tactics. What does that mean? All right, where's that squad? Oh, look what we found. Yeah, keep moving to the drop point. I do want to break that before it spawns something, so let's just do that. Corporal strike, please. And that's a dead building. It changes the color of the map. That thing is still repairing. Okay, need artillery support right now. Coordinates given. Rounds out. Beautiful. Next. How do I make you guys a group? I can make you a group and then I can actually call it in. Thunk Thunk. How you guys doing over here? Kind of getting wrecked by a building. Really do need artillery right here or this squad's dead. Come on. Come on. Two squads left. Good hit. The QB1s. Yeah, they've got it. They've got it. All right, let's lock this down. Get those turrets. How's the actual assault doing? Uh, fine. Sort of. Is that A6 ready to go? Yeah, it's good to go. You guys will be fine once that arrives. Stick together. Don't get spread out or you're going to not make it. Hey, Zero Wizard. Welcome to the stream. Okay. Hold position. Let's wait for the third one to catch up. I wonder who's got better range here. I would say it should be the um, ATTEs because of that massive cannon on the top. Whereas these would have like a higher fire rate because they can rotate. Like they're cooling off the barrels with every shot. I don't know what the rotation thing is supposed to be, but that's, that would be my head cannon. It fires, it rotates, it fires, it rotates. Let's go find their other buildings and blow them up. Why, hello! I'm in your house eating your Cheetos. That's a mine. Not worried about that. Let's go ahead and call a bombing run on that and have you, gentlemen, blow that up. Target that. The rest of you hold position. There is no escape. There's no retreat. Enemies in range. We secured a landing zone. Target acquired. Or the game's over. They retreat. All right, ladies and gentlemen. That's going to be the end of this episode, our continuing fight to free the galaxy from the Separatist Alliance. It's going pretty well, I would say. Uh, I look forward to reading your comments from this video and answer, ask some interesting questions. I'm also curious, and I don't know when or if we're going to do this, uh, but would you like to see like an all-day stream that we wrap up this campaign where we run the last like five or six planets uh, so we can get the, other, the, the next campaign going? Um, or normal episodes of this series to see what happens with that cruel AI. I'm interested. I'll see you all in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Bye, everybody.